Wow, look, volcanoes. This is this neat. What do you think we should name this place? Guy making it really obvious he doesn't want to be here. <sighs> Boring lava field, Oregon. It's canon now. Supervillains announcing their plans is actually a union thing, so they can't be sued for damages someone else may commit at the same time. No, your honor. I clearly stated that I would be using my freeze ray to weaken and shatter the federal bank vault door as my weapon, as you call it. It was only designed to create cold. I cannot be held accountable for this woman's burn injuries clearly caused by another supervillain's lava gun. You are certain that it was another device that caused this woman's injuries? Yes, your honor. Witnessed it myself. Would you tell me the name of this other supervillain? Oh, no, ma'am. Union code. Snitches get stitches. Why aren't you exploring the ocean? It's literally right underneath us! You can send a robot a million miles into space looking for aliens, but not into the giant void that takes up the majority of the Earth we live on? Please, I'm scared. NASA knows. NASA has seen the dark beneath. NASA's urgency to leave the planet grows ever stronger. Have y'all ever had communion bread that was just so... nasty? Like, I know we have to suffer as Christians, but do we really need to have whole wheat bread as the body of Christ? My old church used Hawaiian bread. My standards are high. Some old housemates of mine were Syrian Orthodox. At their church, different members of the church took turns making the bread that would be consecrated for the Eucharist. This was all well and good until one woman baked raisin bread. This led to a memorable occasion of a rather flustered priest who had not seen the bread until that moment declaring, This, except for the raisins, is the body of Christ. <laughs> except for the raisins! <laughs> oh my god! Well, raisins are just dried grapes, though, and wine is his blood, so really, it's like a two-in-one shampoo and conditioner except for Jesus? I'm sorry, just like a two-in-one shampoo and conditioner except for Jesus! Honey, I hate to break this to you, but if blood is wine is inside the body as bread, then that's just a regular-ass human body. Behold, a man! Casual reminder that Nani was on her way to becoming a professional surfer before her parents died and she had to drop everything to look after Lilo. How did I not know this? In Germany, we don't say, I don't care. We say, das ist mir Wurst, which roughly translate as, this is sausage to me. And I think that's beautiful. No, you don't understand. We actually do do that. I crashed my car into a bridge. This is sausage to me! The lack of context here is thrilling. It's introductory Python programming course. Yes! But the plot twist, they're cobras. To the prankster who put the moon as the address on their online pizza delivery order, thanks a whole dang lot. I was up there for like 10 minutes just aimlessly waiting, ringing the doorbell, and kicking moon rocks around. Ugh. Waste my time 2021. Fun fact, this is Orlando's legit impression of Johnny. It wasn't originally scripted. Was there like, was there even a script for this film? Every time I see a post about Pirates of the Caribbean, they're like, this wasn't scripted. By now, I'm just like 70% sure they just released Orlando, Kira, and Johnny into the Caribbean and told them to pretend it was the 1700s. I mean, yay. Um, I, I, I think they're dry. Oh, this place is haunted, haunted. Oh, shit, now it's serious! Imagine banana with any other vowel. Bonunu, banane, bonono, no, binini, banana! What was the original purpose for this website? Because something went wrong along the way. Don't you just love how mental disorders are basically buy one, get seven free? Don't even really want the first one. My mom made me buy it. Lines of family heirloom passed down through generations. I fucking hate it. The absolute worst thing a fictional character can do is admit to liking a food because the fandom will make that their entire personality for the rest of time. How the fuck did we even get to a point where purple guy from FNAF likes toast? How we do that? Boy, if you don't give me my agenda back right this minute, why, I oughta. Oh, that goddamn Tompkins kids is running off with agendas again. That little scamp. Okay, we're settling this discourse right now. Put your zodiac sign in the tags, and if you like or dislike, 
pineapple on pizza, mint ice cream or mint chocolate, ketchup and mac and cheese, or fries dipped in ice cream. Okay, I'm a Pisces. Definitely love pineapple pizza. Mint ice cream's pretty baller. Fries dipped in ice cream? That shit, what's up? But who the fuck puts ketchup in mac and cheese?